Welcome back. It's now time to unmask one of the most misunderstood phenomena of our time, crop circles. Observers around the world continue to speculate about the significance of these intricate patterns of flattened wheat. Where do they come from? Why are they here? And what is their meaning? Tonight, we'll put the mystery to rest once and for all. Crop circles. Elaborate circular formations of flattened crops that appear mysteriously in the dark of night. These frequently complex patterns have been documented around the globe, some said to date back as far as the 1600s. Their beauty is undisputed, but the origin of crop circles has sparked a heated debate. Some claim they are created by supernatural forces. Others point to ghosts, paranormal activity, even alien spacecrafts. Most circles appear in barley or wheat fields, the majority having been found in the English countryside near the sacred site of Stonehenge. To this day, there is no official explanation of how these circles are created. However, some researchers point to this amateur home video recorded near Oliver's Castle in England. Watch closely just below the two flashing light sources. In a matter of seconds, their combined energy appears to carve a series of perfect circles in the crop. Did you see it? Take another look. The wheat appears to simply give way to the extraordinary rotation of white lights. While they may disagree on the origins of crop circles, many paranormal experts agree that these phenomena are the result of a higher intelligence. They base their claims on at least four distinct attributes inherent in all genuine crop circles. First is the fact that there is no physical evidence of human construction. No marks left by machines, no holes in the ground, no disturbance to the surrounding crop, and most important, no footprints. More on that later. Second, experts claim the crops display complex woven patterns that are not created by weight or force. The stalks simply bend to lie flat and are rarely broken. Third, the intricate patterns are said to be based on sacred geometry, precise geometric principles that govern the growth process of all organic life. And fourth is sheer size. Believers claim it is not humanly possible to create such enormous patterns in so little time, some as large as eight football fields in length, mysteriously appearing in just one night. And there's another important attribute we're forgetting. According to researchers, in the thousands of circles identified throughout the world, no one has ever been caught in the act of making one. That is, until now. Take another look at this amateur home video footage. Could this really be the answer? Don't bet on it. As the sun rises above the ripened crops of New Zealand, another discovery is made. Strange markings created by unknown visitors. The design resembles one discovered in the English countryside near Stonehenge in July of 1996. As expected, the crop circle makes front page news in southern New Zealand. The report asks all the standard questions. Who or what created this and where did they come from? Well, tonight, for the first time on network television, the mystery is finally unmasked. The strange visitors have traveled a great distance, but they flew coach. They're called Circle Makers, three London-based artists who create their masterpieces under the cover of darkness. And they've agreed to show you step by step how it's done. The elaborate formation they've chosen to create is not the result of the latest computer drawing software. Just a design they liked and sketched out earlier in the day. With their car parked at a safe distance for a clean getaway, the three men prepare to unload their secret equipment. And it's not what you might expect. Rope, wood planks, and surveyor's tape. That's it. You don't believe it? Watch. With their tools in hand, the small team make their way into the field. Remember the claim that the surrounding crops are not disturbed? Well, that's not entirely true. A closer look reveals some footprints can be found. Often the ground is hard, and by following the tram lines, few footprints, if any, are left. In the unlikely event they are found, they're usually attributed to subsequent visitors to the formation, making it a win-win situation. 
The tram lines are paths in the crop used by farmers for planting, fertilizing, and harvesting equipment. This shot shows our team entering the field. Upon arriving at a predetermined location within the crop, one team member stands at a center point while another begins to mark the first circle out. Nothing is pounded into the ground. Remember, they leave without a trace. Working outward from the center, the circle makers begin the swirling pattern by flattening down the crop with their homemade wood planks. The planks, called stock stompers, are different sizes, each with holes on the ends where the rope is looped through. Remember the third attribute of all genuine crop circles, sacred geometry? Well, the circle makers confess they're not interested in that. If it works out that the design means something to those who discover it, all the better. Having said that, the key to this crop circle is the tram lines. And as luck would have it, the tram lines are exactly 48 feet apart. 48 is divisible by 6, and 6 is an important number in sacred geometry. In fact, all of the diameters of all of the circles in the main formation are divisible by 6. For years, the circle makers have shared an interest in the paranormal, and they've collaborated on a wide range of projects, including fine art and photography. The three men made the jump from traditional artists to covert artists in 1994, when they first teamed up to make crop circles. Why do they do it? The strange formations were frequently appearing near their hometown without any rational explanation as to how they were made. They finally decided to see if it was humanly possible to create one and they weren't disappointed. Within hours, the formation is complete. Making sure not to leave any incriminating evidence behind, the circle makers make their getaway. But what about the final claim believers make about genuine crop circles? The fact that it's humanly impossible to create such enormous patterns in such a short amount of time. We thought you'd want to see this for yourself. To prove once and for all that this formation is not the result of elaborate equipment or television trickery, we placed a time-lapse camera 140 feet above the crop. One picture is taken every 17 seconds. Take a look as three men with some boards and rope finally unmask one of the world's most mysterious scams in under six hours. If supernatural forces are involved, they're doing it the hard way. Our time is up. We hope you've enjoyed this inside look at the dark world of deception and the methods used to make the impossible seem real. So remember, if it looks too good to be true, it probably is. I'm Judd Nelson. Good night.